Hello and welcome. In this video, I'll walk you through WebUI, a web-based interface that lets you monitor, configure, and control your OpenVMS system directly from your browser. Let's get started. Here's the login screen. All you need is your OpenVMS username and password to log in and access your system. Once you've logged in, you'll land on your dashboard. This gives you a quick overview of your system, things like CPU and memory usage, input-output activity, and the number of running processes. Let's take a closer look at those. Here we have a list of processes currently running on your system. Each column gives you useful info, process ID, name, status, and more. If you click on a process ID, you can view detailed information and also take action, like suspending it, resuming it, or making other changes. Let's move on to install products, also known as PCSI. This section shows you everything currently installed on your system. You can see the product names, versions, and some quick actions. If you click on a product name, you'll see more details, including when it was installed, by whom, and whether it's ever been removed. You can also download that history as a TXT file if you need to keep a record. Next up is the Write Identifier section. In this section, you'll find all system rights defined. Clicking on an entry shows full details, including association and privileges. Now let's take a look at the system storage. Here you can see a list of all these devices available. In this case, there are five. Clicking on any of them gives you detailed information like size, status, and other being used. Now let's check out the network settings. In the TCP IP section, you can manage the host names, view interfaces and services, and make changes when needed. Clicking on an item opens up more detailed configuration options. From there, you can edit settings, disable a service, or remove it altogether. Now let's go to user management. Here you can add a new user by entering details like the username, UIC, default directory, and other fields, just like you would from the terminal, but with a clearer interface. You can also manage existing users, change their passwords, adjust quotas and privileges, or disable and delete accounts if needed. Next, we have license management. This view shows you all the licenses currently installed on your system. If you need to remove one, for example, the availability manager license, you can find it using the search bar, then click on it and select delete. To register a new license, you can either fill out the form manually, paste a DCL registration script, or import it from a file. WebUI also includes a built-in terminal. It works just like a traditional OpenVMS session, giving you full system access, all from your browser. When you're finished, simply log out to ensure your session is safely closed and your system stays protected. All right, this was a quick look at WebUI. Thanks for watching.